Hello everyone and thank you so much for watching. The name of my channel is Diada and I would appreciate if you will subscribe and make like to my channel. Today we will talk for Olympia Eau de Parfum Paco Rabanne. This perfume is launched in 2015 and the idea is uh, to bring the um, Athen goddess, the Greek goddess from the old mythology. That's why we have made also a little bit atmosphere here for the perfume. This perfume from 2015 it was a bestseller in the market. I could smell it everywhere in many girls walking in the streets, in restaurants, everywhere. Many boys I asked, they told me uh, they had a girlfriend who smelled like Olympia. So with uh, good perfumes who selling good it's a little bit tricky side because uh, it can remind you to somebody. I liked it very much when I smelled it for the first time. I smelled it to a girl and it just came and I went to ask this girl what are you wearing. She told me I'm wearing Olympia and she was like surprised that uh, I liked it. And after I went to buy it also. The first impression I had in 2015 was like uh, like a heavenly smell. Yeah, it's really fitted with the name Olympia. Now I don't have any more the first kick that I had because my nose have uh, custom to this smell. This is the second time I purchased uh, the bottle. First bottle I finished totally that it's rarely happen. Mostly I let the bottle still half and uh, they are still in my collection but this one I finished all. And when I found it again in discount I thought why not to repurchase it for a second time. Some notes in this uh, perfume. Uh, there are uh, vanilla it's a main note in a salty way. We have salt note and top notes there are water jasmine, green mandarin, ginger flower. Base notes are cashmere wood, ambergris and sandal wood. The note that I smell most here, even I know the smell, I'd like to spray it again. First note I smell is vanilla, uh, salt and uh, orange. Orange is uh, very dominating together with vanilla. They make such a beautiful combination. After Olympia was coming uh, in the market and was a successful perfume, the brand Paco Rabanne, they did a lot of other... Uh, they bring a lot of other bottles of the perfume, or Intense, Legend Olympia, but uh, no one of uh, the other perfumes was having the big success from the first Olympia of the perfume. The main, the main perfume is uh, Invictus. It was coming, I think, two years before Olympia. Um, Invictus was also uh, Invictus was also a bestseller and was created in 2013. So it was exactly two years after was coming Olympia. Let's go back to the notes. The, the notes are uh, well balanced with each other. Uh, it's a well done perfume. I would nothing put away or uh, put more or put away. The longevity of the perfume is very good. It's a long lasting one. The project, uh, projection is very good and the sillage is very good. Where I would put this perfume? I would put it everywhere. I would put it during the day, during the night. Even for season, I think this does not have a season. So it's a well done. The only problem is that uh, now everybody had it. Or 
Everybody knows somebody who had it. The perfume is created from three perfumers. Two of them I already know. They are famous. They have done a lot of perfumes. Anne Filippo and Dominique Rupion uh, is the one I know. And the third one is Lok Dong. This perfume I would see more uh, young girl, also a woman till 40 year old. I don't see this perfume a lot to a mature woman with a serious uh, work or serious clothes. I see more this perfume as a fun perfume. Um, it would be very nice to gift uh, this to somebody. Uh, it's very likable and it would be nice for birthday gift or for new year gift. But the person has to like vanilla and sweet perfumes. Uh, the price for Olympia, I think it's about uh, 70 euro um, to 100 euro for 50 ml and 100 ml bottle. For next time, uh, I will talk in my channel for tuberose flower as the main note in perfumes, and I have here five perfume with tuberose main note: is Tom Ford, Lancome. I have the new one from Gucci Bloom 2020, again Tuberose May Not, PTQ Perfume, uh, Tuberose Imperial and Hermes Twilly. Uh, thank you very much for watching today and I will, will appreciate that you do subscribe to my channel and uh, it would be nice if you will write in my comments below what you want that I speak next next time. Thank you very much for watching and see you to the next video.